The stage itself, when you sort of look back at history and you look at stone, the way it just sort of stands out, it's very, very primal because I think that's where sound came from. And in the Indian classical tradition, we have the whole concept of Nad and Aum as being the primal sound. And we looked at about the sun and the moon, and that's actually what's reflected on the stage. It also meant that, you know, where is Indian classical music heading? So we wanted something that was modern, contemporary, yet still held something from its history.